Hey, what's good, YouTube? Um, I'm feeling really, really called right now to, to share this video with you because um, as an honest business strategist and an honest business coach, um, we're really living in troubling times nowadays because there are so many con artists out here selling the public on this fallacy that you can just build a business overnight you could start this amazing business make six figures seven figures eight figures uh, automatically you know there's a done for you template that's gonna make you super super successful you're not gonna have to do anything you're just gonna have to follow this proven formula and you'll be wealthy and be able to live your dreams happily ever after and just the fact that the matter is is this, that that is so not true for 99% of entrepreneurs out there Starting a business is going to be a very long and arduous process because it's not that easy. It's very, very difficult. But if you do build it the right way, you're going to get amazing results. And one of the oldest tricks of the game is just to sell people on this idea that you can get rich quick overnight. And a lot of people have made a lot of money, you know, selling people on this idea of instantaneous success. But if you just really think about it, instantaneous success isn't something that's really sustainable. It's something that happens really, really quick and it fizzles out. A really good analogy is just looking at professional athletes or even better, people who've won the lottery. And people who don't know how to manage money or people who don't appreciate this opportunity or people who don't understand how to manage what they've been given oftentimes blow this wealth or this instantaneous money overnight and they don't recover from it. Well, the same thing is true in business. And you have to understand that there is so much truth in this idea that you have to build a business. And when you think about building something, particularly a building itself, a lot of buildings are built brick by brick. And the buildings that are built the strongest are the ones that are going to endure and last over time. And I don't know about you, but for me, I didn't get into business just to get money quick and then just disappear. You know, I got into business because I want to build something that's going to last a lifetime, something that's going to create this sustainable income that's not only going to bring wealth and blessings to me, but it's going to be something that I could pass down onto the next generation and next generations of, you know, my, my family. Because I don't want them to have to go through what, I, what I'm going through right now, you know, and what, and what kind of caused me to get into entrepreneurship was that, which was the inability to, to, to find a job. And so it's super, super important that you're very, very intentional with understanding this concept of building a business brick by brick. Because when you do that, you're going to be building something that's going to endure over the long term. And when something endures over the long term, it's going to bring in that income that's going to sustain you over a longer period of time. And one quick story to kind of really illustrate this uh, kind of takes me back to my um, life experience in Peru. So for many of you who've been watching my channel, a lot of y'all know that I studied abroad in Peru and also immigrated back there to open up one of the country's first branded craft distilleries. But what was really fascinating about that experience was getting to travel throughout the country. And one of the, the greatest sites in all of Peru is the, or are the Incan ruins at Machu Picchu. Now, Machu Picchu is this crazy fortress that's built up on the mountains in the jungle of Cusco, Peru. And just looking at it, it just blows your mind because you're like, how in the hell did these ancient archaic people figure out how to build such a structure that has lasted for literally, you know, 500, 600, um, 700 years and it's still intact. But when you start to really analyze the Machu Picchu and the, and the structure of it, what you'll begin to see is that like it's composed of like all these individual stones and these stones are massive. Like they're the size of this, of this bookshelf or, or bigger, but these stones are so intricate, intricately cut and perfectly placed that you don't, that the Incans didn't need any glue or any special adhesives to make sure that everything was put together perfectly. These structures are built with such detail that you can't even 
place a, um, um, a sheet of paper in between these these stones or these ink and bricks because they're so perfectly cut. What's even more fascinating is that Peru is an area that's known for having a lot of earthquakes and a lot of tremors. And over time, you know, you've had the um, Spanish conquistadors, they built their buildings, they collapsed during the uh, earthquakes and tremors. You look at some of the modern buildings that were built out of steel, uh, rebar, concrete, those things got destroyed <laughs> during many of these earthquakes and tremors. But if you look at a lot of the Incan ruins, including Machu Picchu and others, many of them were able to withstand a lot of those uh, earthquakes and tremors because of the way that these buildings were built with such intention. Like, the, like, the, like I said, those Incan bricks are absolutely massive, but they're so perfectly cut and perfectly placed that for some reason, when the earth moves, these stones are able to be flexible enough to vibrate with the earth's movement so that the building a structure doesn't collapse. It's able to kind of go with the flow. And so that analogy that I'm painting for you here is the same thing you want to see uh, with your business. It's like you want to build something that's going to endure the test of time because guess what? Every day, your business is going to experience either a little tremor or a major earthquake that could completely wipe out your business uh, instantaneously. And so if you build your, your business slowly, brick by brick, with intention, with purpose, you're going to wind up building something that's going to endure the test of time and it's going to bless you with wealth, with freedom, more time with your family, more time with your friends, uh, more opportunity to travel, you name it. And it's, and it's really, really hard because a lot of people, like I said, when I introduced this conversation, a lot of people are just coming out of fucking thin air to come tell you that, hey, you can just build this thing overnight. You can just start from nothing and get to the penthouse level overnight. And guess what? Like if you're able to do that, you're probably going to be standing on a structure that's insufficient and that's going to collapse whenever one of these inevitable business earthquakes or tremors come through. And so I just feel really, really called just to share that story with you right now, because with me and my business, like, you know, every day it's like, damn, another thing that I have to do, another system I have to put in place because I was sold on these ideas that, hey, you know, if you create a YouTube channel, you build a digital business, you're going to be making all this passive income and you're going to be able to live happily ever after. And yes, it's possible. But there's so many intricacies. There's so many little structures that I have to build within my business to get to that point. And every day it's just like I have to lay another brick, another brick, and another brick. But by doing this, I'm building a business that's going to, you know, create generational wealth. It's going to stand the test of time. And it's going to be something that uh, isn't just going to disappear whenever uh, another COVID comes through or another earthquake or another uh, kind of Tim Bloor uh, uh, tremor. Uh, <laughs> I'm speaking Spanish right now. Comes through to wipe out your business. So, um, yeah, this is just coming straight from the soul. You know, I just freestyle this straight up, but I really hope it adds value to you. And just understand that, like, success does not come overnight. I mean, it, it's going to take time. You're going to have to build your business brick by brick. But when you do that, it's going to be something that's um, going to pay massive dividends for you. So if you're ready to become the entrepreneur of your life, uh, please subscribe to this channel and also be sure to click the notification bell to be alerted for whenever new videos drop. And um, my question for you is, are you willing to build your business brick by brick or are you just going to try to take a shortcut uh, to get rich quick? You know, it depends on you. <laughs> You, you're going to traverse your own path, but if you go the slow and steady race, uh, you'll be rewarded for that. So um, until next time.